Hey guys, welcome to the Fishing Report this week. Hey, we're mid-December, just a little bit before Christmas, live in the great big new Domka outdoor setup here at the Monroe Mall, right here in Monroe. For those of you who don't know, Dave moved his whole store from his old location to the Monroe Mall. It's an awesome spot, 56,000 square feet. He's got everything in this store. But let's talk about Monroe fishing, and then we'll get back to some of the stuff that Dave's got in the store that'll help you put fish in your boat. So uh, Dan Woodward from Blue Line Charters has been out fishing now recently out of both Bulls and Sterling State Park. We've got Tim Otten who sent us a great uh, fishing report as well for Sterling State Park. I know Nick Dode is headed down here uh, to also fish, fish this week. And the fishing's really good right now. It's December, it's Monroe time. And uh, what's been working? Well, I'll tell you what, you have to search a little bit. You know, you can't just go out there and blindly set lines like maybe over in the northern side of uh, mid-Ohio. Uh, you do want to graph around a little bit and find some marks. Once you do, uh, the fishing's been very good. All of these guys had great success. They were fishing mostly from that 18 to 23 foot of water band. That seems to be where the best fish are holding right now. Um, speeds has been really differing uh, from day to day. I've had guys say that they really needed to slow down to one two to one four to catch fish. And then I had one guy say that he was doing really good at one six all day long. Uh, what is important is you find good water color. Uh, you don't want it to be too dingy, too dirty. Uh, hasn't been a ton of wind lately, so you should be able to go out there and find some decent water color. I like to find that chalky colored green uh, that you get at this time of the year late in the season. But I'll tell you what, as you see these pictures go across the screen, some really nice fish being caught. Monroe is loading up every single day more and more as these fish migrate from the Ohio waters into the Michigan waters and they're gonna start staging up in Breast Bay all the way down uh, to Bulls Harbor to hold for the winter time prior to going up into the Detroit River. Now, what's been working really good? Well, Dave, as you know, is probably one of the premier bait painters here in the United States. He's got a huge selection behind me of bandits, also a great big selection of custom reapers. Uh, and I'm just gonna grab a few of my favorite baits uh, that we've been using here in the fall and I'm just gonna hold them up in front of the camera. You won't see my face, which is fine, but those baits have really been doing good. So we've got the Antifreeze Huff Daddy Bandit and also uh, you could probably talk Dave into painting that for you for a reaper. Uh, We've got D's Nuts, this middle one, that's been a really good color. It's uh, got an orange belly with a pink sides. That's been really good, especially in stained water. And then the Double D Bandit. This one really, really is another one that works good in stained water because you get that contrast of the purple, white, purple with pink dots. That really helps the walleyes hone in on them. Now, I like to use the antifreeze colored base baits when it's either cloudy or dark out. You, it also works good in sun. That's one of the reasons antifreeze as a base color is such a good go-to color. It kind of works when chrome works, but it also works when gold works, which really makes it an ambidextrous bait, if you will. So those are three of my better colors that I really go to right away. These are all Domka colors. One thing you want to make sure you do is if you're going to, let's say you're going to grab um, some some different colors in baits that you that Dave doesn't normally necessarily paint. Let's say you're really wanting to increase your arsenal of deep reapers. Um, as long as you get a hold of Dave or Aaron at the store and you know maybe order a half a dozen of each color, they can pretty much have orders sent out to have those baits painted for you over this lag period here now from Christmas until early March when that big lake bite is going to start up again. This is the perfect time of the year to get a hold of Dave and Aaron, put an order of baits in that you want, and just get them through the store ordered and shipped right to you rather than dealing with the free-for-all that happens in the spring. Plus, when you do it that way, you're able then to make sure you're gonna have your baits when the season starts. 
Uh, and this is the time of the year where they've got the time to actually fill those orders. So, you know, if you've got four or five colors of Domka paints that you really want, but you want it in a Deep Reaper, or you want it in a different brand bait, just get a hold of them, let them know, put that bait order together, they can ship it out. And it might take a little bit longer than normal, but right now you've got that three or four month window to get that order placed and get it back to you so you can use it. And I'll tell you what, guys, I did this all year long with Reapers and Dead Eye Minnows as I slowly got an arsenal together of baits that I really liked and uh, it put a lot of fish in my boat. So this is a really good suggestion for you, you know. Also, take time to come on down to the store. This is the biggest store in Southeast Michigan. It is jam packed with everything, rain gear, ice fishing equipment, a full archery center with shooting range, full gun, gun department. Dave and Aaron have got it going on here. Monroe, Michigan in the old Monroe Mall right here in Monroe and come on down, have a great time. You can browse, it's real relaxed. It's not a free for all down here right now. This time of the year, it gets busy of course with Christmas, but in the midweek, this is the time to come and browse, pick out or get with them to place an order. Midwest Steel Carports is Michigan's premier steel building manufacturer. We manufacture and install custom steel buildings throughout Michigan. Our engineer certified steel buildings are fully tailored to fit your every need and our up to 40 year warranty protects your investment. From residential storage sheds to commercial warehouses, let our team work with you to find your ideal building. For more information and pricing, visit MidwestSteelCarports.com. So hey, great report coming to you from Monroe, Michigan. Again, every single day that you get stable weather, there's gonna be tens of thousands of fish moving into the Monroe and Michigan waters there out of either Bowles or Sterling State Park. That's not an exaggeration. Tens of thousands of fish will be moving into Michigan waters from the Ohio waters right now this time of year. This is when we see the biggest fish caught out of Monroe and also uh, the best opportunity for a real, you know, fish of a lifetime. So get a hold of either Nick Dode from Real Live Action Sport Fishing, uh, Dan Woodward from Blue Line Charters is also doing charters on the big water until it's absolutely out of the question. And trust me, with the 40 degrees that we're having here early this week, uh, that water is very, very fishable. So get a hold of one of those two guys and have a great time.